Aloha, my name is Nick, and I'm an intern at Hawaii Marine Animal Response here on Oahu. I feel really lucky to be part of the Marine Debris team, being able to dive with some really amazing people. Uh, we go out to try to remove dangerous marine debris like fishing line, hooks, nets, etc. Uh, this is in an attempt to conserve Hawaii's precious marine wildlife. I wanted to take a minute and show everyone at home a little bit about how we operate and how that translates into conserving Hawaii's marine wildlife including my favorite animal, the Hawaiian monk seal. To accomplish our mission of reducing the dangerous marine debris from the nearshore waters, our team of volunteers, interns, and staff dive at locations across Oahu. We specifically focus on locations with heavy fishing pressure, areas where we believe there will be a lot of monofilament fishing line. Once we are on location, debrief, and are in the water, the mission is simple. Buddy up, stick to the dive route, and carefully remove any debris that we find along the way. One thing that we face at almost every dive is fishing line that wraps around the reef. As most of you know, the reefs are the scaffolding of the marine ecosystem. Like the ohia tree attracts forest wildlife, coral reef attracts all sorts of marine wildlife. These corals covered in fishing line become an entanglement hazard for all of these visiting animals, like the green sea turtle or the critically endangered Hawaiian monk seal. As well, these fishing lines suffocate and strangle the coral, effectively killing it. Due to that, we focus on doing our best to carefully remove, disentangle, and cut any fishing line away from the reefs. Our efforts have allowed us to remove dozens of entanglement hazards. At the moment, Hawaiian monk seal populations hover around 1,300 to 1,400, with only about 40 individuals living on Oahu. It's our mission at Hawaii Marine Animal Response to give Hawaii's marine wildlife the best chance at surviving any way we can, whether it be in the water with the marine debris team or the outreach we provide across the island. For more information, visit h-mar.org.